Hey guys, welcome back to Living in the Mom Lane. My name is Mandy and welcome back to another grocery haul. I hope you enjoy. So starting over here, I have a milk for Amelia or for recipes and things. I also picked up some grits. There's a recipe that calls for grits. I have never had them before. I know Jason likes them and my oldest daughter likes grits, but I've never made them and I've never had them. I think I've maybe tasted theirs before, but wasn't a huge fan, but I thought I would give it a try again. And I got the girls or Jason some more ice cream sandwiches. I also picked up some cottage cheese and sour cream. These are for recipes. I'll show you my meal plan in just a minute. And I got some more heavy whipping cream. This was for a couple of recipes, I believe. And I also use it in my coffee as well. And some sharp white cheddar cheese. Um, <laughs> Amelia's back there eating her lunch. I think she's always in here when I'm doing these grocery hauls. She's always in the background. I also picked up some more Cheez-Its and Ritz crackers. Those are for a specific recipe. And then a can of cannellini beans and Rotel diced tomatoes. And then a recipe called for mayonnaise and it specified Hellman's mayonnaise. So I don't normally buy Hellman's, but I thought I would go ahead and buy it since this cookbook suggested that. And then also another recipe called for ground white pepper. Finally, I was able to get some because I've had other recipes that's called for white pepper and I never could find it in the store, but they had it. It was organic, but um, actually the organic was cheaper than the other bottle that was on the website. So I went ahead and got the organic kind. And I got some tomato juice. We don't drink tomato juice, but there are certain recipes that call for it. So that is why I bought some. I just get the little cans because like I said, we don't drink it or anything. And if a recipe just calls for half a cup or something, I don't want this big jug of tomato juice and it go to waste. And then I picked up some hoagie rolls. These are not the ones that I had picked out. Uh, these are a substitute of what I wanted, but I don't remember exactly which ones I had picked out. And I got some long grain uh, white rice and a package of fajita mix. This is for a particular recipe. And then I picked up two thin ribeye steaks. They look pretty good. Um, this is for a recipe as well. And Jason requested some turkey um, sandwich meat for snacking on when he's at home. And then I got some fresh spinach. This is for a recipe and two bags of mild cheddar cheese. I actually picked out the eight ounce bags. I think I had two eight ounce bags. They didn't have that, so they gave me two 16 ounce bags, which is even better. The thing I like about Walmart is if you order a certain item and they don't have it and they have to give you a different item, um, if that item costs more than what you originally picked out, you pay for what you originally picked out. Or if the item that you get is actually cheaper than what you picked out, then you pay the cheaper price. So I really like that about Walmart. I know Instacart does not do that. They go ahead and change the prices. And then I'm gonna be making some cabbage rolls. So I needed a head of cabbage and a Vidalia sweet onion. I got two pounds of asparagus, three zucchinis, a poblano pepper and some cheese tortellini. We really liked the cheese tortellini, but this is for a different recipe that I'm gonna be cooking this week. And then I got a pack of strawberries. Those look really good and some parsley. I wanted to get a parsley plant um, so I could put it out on my patio with my basil and my mint, but they didn't have it. And then I wanted a bunch of parsley and they didn't have that. So they substituted it with this little tiny package, which I guess is okay for now. And that is it. I don't remember the total. I will put it up on the screen for you. Now let me show you my meal plan. Today is Sunday. So for dinner, we're gonna do skillet potato hash and fried eggs. This entire week's meals 
for dinner is going to be from uh, Joanna Gaines's new cookbook. The, I forget what it's called, um, but they're all from her new cookbook. So I'm really excited to try all of these. So Tuesday or Monday, Monday we're gonna have spinach tortellini soup. That's what the cheese tortellini's for. Tuesday we're gonna have Philly cheese steaks. Uh, Wednesday we're gonna have chicken pecan asparagus casserole. Thursday shrimp and grits. Friday we're having chicken parmesan and then a side salad. And Saturday we're gonna do the cabbage rolls. So that's the meal plan. So be on the lookout for a what's for dinner with all of these yummy dishes in them. Yummy dishes. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed it. It was a short and sweet grocery haul this time. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Stay safe, and I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye. girls or Jason some more ice cream sandwiches they've been oh, <clears throat> oh my goodness is out of breath and Jason requested turkey breast Blech. you got that something that can't be seen you got that one thing that's hard to come by it's not your styling it's not your jeans, know what you got is deeper within